Hi, I'm Daniel Andrews, owner and creator of the DAN Show, and welcome to the second pick in my 2022 NFL mock draft. Today, I'm going to break down the Detroit Lions and what they're going to do with the second overall pick in the 2022 NFL draft. Now, before I get going, if you haven't done it already, hit that subscribe button. And while you're at it, ring the bell. That way you're notified every time I come out with a new video. Now, look, if you're a Lions fan, this definitely is the channel for you. You need to catch my live stream. I go live every Friday night. I have a great Detroit Lions following. So if, join my join the live stream if you want to talk some Detroit Lions football. Now, also in the link below, you're going to see a description to the Luke G Field Review. My boy Luke G, all he does is talk Lions. He talks all Detroit. Detroit sports it's definitely a channel you want to check out I do all 32 teams Luke G just does the Lions so I'm gonna put that link in the description below now who do the Lions take with the second pick in the draft first off the Lions would love to trade down uh, last year they aced the draft every single player drafted ended up making a team and playing and all their draft picks are going to make the team for this year they already have five picks in the first 97 selections of the 2022 nfl draft but they would love to go ahead and add more this would be the lions first choice however there are no trades in this mock draft and even though i do believe the lions want to trade down I don't think they're going to get a good enough offer. I've seen several mock drafts with the Lions trading down, especially with the Giants at pick number five. But I think the Lions ultimately will end up using the second pick on, on a player. The Lions' biggest need is that wide receiver. But I, I don't see the Lions taking a wide receiver at number two uh, overall in the draft. Uh, there's not a Calvin Johnson prospect available that that you would take number two overall. Now, the Lions will draft a wide receiver. There's a very good chance they use multiple draft picks on wide receivers, but I don't see them taking a wide receiver at number two overall. They could use a pick at either 32 or 34 on a wide receiver, just not at number two. Quarterback could also be in play here. And I've seen multiple mock drafts with the Lions taking a quarterback, but I've seen them taking a quarterback at pick number 32. And if the Lions use the 32nd pick on the draft for a quarterback, that makes a lot of sense. It doesn't make sense uh, for the Lions to use the second overall pick on, on a quarterback. I think that they need a player who's going to be an impact player this year, uh, and I don't think there's a quarterback worthy of the second overall pick in this draft. Now, Luke G loves Kyle Hamilton, and if you follow my show, there's lots of Lions fans that, that want Kyle, Kyle Hamilton, but at number two, I, I think it's just too rich. Now, I do love Hamilton, and I would love Hamilton on the Lions, but I wouldn't want it at two. If the Lions trade down, Hamilton could be in play, but I don't see it at number two overall. But I do have the Lions using this pick on the defensive player. So without further ado, with the second pick in the 2022 NFL Draft, the Detroit Lions select Aiden Hutchinson, defensive end out of Michigan. Now, Lions fans, I know there's going to be a lot of you who aren't going to like this pick, but, but here's the facts. Your defense is terrible. All right, you were 29th in yards. You were 31st in points allowed, giving up 27 and a half points per game. And only Atlanta and Philly had fewer sacks. In Hutchinson, you get somebody who not only has excellent, terrific uh, production. Remember, you finished second overall in Heisman Ballotin, but you get somebody who's the very definition of a kneecap biter. Hutchinson is a very solid double. I mean, this is a day one starter who's going to help stuff the run, rush the passer, and improve your front seven immediately. Now, I did think about Kavion Thibodeau, but Hutchinson has a much higher floor, probably the highest floor of anybody in this draft. At worst, you're going to get a 10-year starter with steady production, and not only stuffing the run, but rushing the quarterback. So Lions fans, look, man, what, let me know what you think here. I give you my opinion, but I want to hear from you. Drop a comment below with what you want the Lions to do with the second pick in the 2022 NFL Draft. Now, tomorrow, I'm going to break down the Houston Texans, but if you haven't already, give me a thumbs up. Like the video. If you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Drop a comment below with your opinion, and I will see you tomorrow.